Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Jeff Guyton, President and Chief Executive Officer of Mazda Motor Europe. Hey, good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to Frankfurt and welcome to Mazda. I'm really pleased that you could join us here today. So far in 2013, the European auto industry has recorded its lowest sales in 20 years. And at the same time, Mazda's sales and market share have grown. In fact, compared to last year, we've increased sales by nearly 10%, even while the European market as a whole has contracted. Now, our success has been driven by the first two new products developed with Skyactive technology and Kodo design, namely the CX-5, which we debuted here in Frankfurt two years ago, and the Mazda 6, which launched a year ago in Paris. These two new vehicles have won numerous comparison tests and more than 60 significant automotive awards around the world. And as a result, we've had to expand our CX-5 capacity twice since we introduced the vehicle. And two weeks ago, we announced plans to increase Skyactiv engine capacity by 25% to 1 million units. And while I'm on the subject of manufacturing, our all-new factory in Salamanca, Mexico, will be up and running by the end of our fiscal year. Now, our global success with Skyactiv and Kodo is largely responsible for the dramatic turnaround in Mazda's financial results. So from our unique technology to improving sales figures in Europe, Mazda stands apart from the crowd. Because Mazda people the world over challenge conventional wisdom every single day to make things better. And taking celebration of challengers to an entirely new level, we announced a partnership last week in Warsaw with the recipients of the Nobel Peace Prize to change, to support positive change in our world. Now, with the launch of Mazda 3, we're going to be celebrating challengers in our advertising as well. We looked for people who changed things for the better by doing them completely differently, for people who put conventional thinking aside and followed through on their vision. People like Dick Fosbury, the revolutionary high jumper whose Fosbury flop changed that sport forever. And John Shuttleworth, who started building boats in a way that nobody had tried before. Lighter and stronger, more environmentally friendly, more economical, and great looking on top. And of course, right here on our stand today is our latest example of Mazda's challenger spirit. Now, the first thing about the new Mazda 3 that meets the eye is, of course, its looks. And these shapes have a purpose, too. Whether in sedan or in hatchback version, Mazda 3 has some of the lowest drag coefficients in its class. Underneath the hood, you'll find our convention-defying Skyactiv technology, which uses extreme compression ratios to deliver a unique blend of efficiency and output. Inside the cabin is an all-new information and entertainment system operated via a newly designed human-machine interface, which is logical to operate and simple. And two new items debuting on the Mazda 3 are the active driving display, one of the first heads-up displays in the, available in this segment, and our second-generation rotary commander on the center console. It enables straightforward operation of the car's infotainment functions, so drivers spend more time with their eyes on the road. And speaking of infotainment, we're launching MZD Connect on the new Mazda 3. It's our brand new connectivity concept, and again, it's one of the first available in the C segment. Besides bringing Facebook and Twitter feeds into the car, this system opens up a world of free mobile online content. So thank you again for joining us, everyone. Thank you. Thank you.